Welcome to my channel. My name is Toby and I will be doing a what's on my iPhone 7 plus tag. So when you first turn on my phone, oh, when you first, I have to turn it like this cause like it'll automatically unlock. I just have this like, um, I forgot what it's called. A gradient, I think, background it has a mixture of colors and they're like all put together and blended. I got it from Tumblr. We slide over. It has like all of that widgets and stuff. And then this is the camera. So when you unlock it, the first thing you'll see is like my main page, like what I mostly use, but I'm gonna start from like the first, very first. So yeah, that's just widgets and stuff. By Dangerous Woman on iTunes. Okay. <laughs> So the very first page, or like the second page, or whatever you want to call it, it just has all these main apps. Like, I, I don't feel like I need to like explain, because you should already know what all these are if you ever had iPhone. So yeah, then this main page is what I mainly use, except for these, and then the extras. Like, I'm not going to do any of those, because they're just irrelevant to this video. I don't even care for them. But the very first app will be the Nicki Minaj game. If you don't have it, I highly advise you to go get it like it's so fun it's not like Kim's or Chloe's or um if she doesn't have one Kylie and Kendall and all of them like no this is so different it's so fun and if it will focus whatever and the second game next to that would be fun run arena and like I have a fun run addiction like it's so fun and simple and fun and then next to fun run arena you have like fun run 2 which is an all-time favorite like I feel like if you have a smartphone you haven't got this game like you don't know what you're missing like, let me just let me just play for the one time. Oh god. I'll turn the sign off. Oh well. Okay, and this is basically Fun Run. The next app will be Christmas Countdown. And right now, it is one day. Well, the app says one day till Christmas, which is really two days. So yeah. <laughs> So yeah, that's that. All right, the next app. As you can tell, I'm a big gamer. Like, all I have on my phone is games. It's Harris Align 2. But I don't really like the 2 anymore. I like Harris Align. Oh, Harris Align 3. It's like a major upgrade. Hello, like this. Then you have different people to choose from. It's basically like a game to do something like when you're on the road or something and you're like bored. So you can like snip the hair off, curl it. The next will be Sonic Dash. I feel like everyone knows what Sonic Dash is. If you don't, you just Google it. The next game will be Scribble Knot. The next app will be Bitmoji. It's like this little thing that you can use. Like, if you want to text something to somebody, you don't want it to be all boring or whatever, just have a Bitmoji. And I actually customize mine to look like me. The next app will be Tidal. And if you don't know, oh. <laughs> If you don't know what title is, it is a music application and you can like just play cool music. I don't want to play any music because like it'll probably get copyright on my music or whatever. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, the next app will be Genius and Genius is basically an app like if you want to know certain lyrics to a certain song and I feel like if you like stand somebody like how I stand Nicki Minaj, then you should have this app because like you got to know what your artist is talking about. I gotta know all the lyrics, I wanna get everything right. SoundCloud is a music application as well. Visco, I use this so, like I use this, like this is like the holy grail. If you like like to take pictures or whatever, or have like a fan page or something, and you want really nice filters, I really advise you to get Visco him. Oh yeah. So the next application would be Best Video, and this is basically where I download all my like, funny videos or whatever from Instagram, but unfortunately it is not on the App Store anymore. The next app would be Wells Fargo, you know, that's my bank. Snapchat, I'm not gonna open that, but Snapchat is really fun. You guys should add me and I'll put it on the video like, right now. The, what? Third page, I will have a layout, and that's basically like for um an app for borders for Instagram pictures and stuff like that. The next I will be cleaner, and this is like what I use to like um follow people who don't follow back or inactive or stuff like that. Flipagram, everyone knows what Flipagram is. Twitter, you know, everyone knows what Twitter is. Periscope, where I can just watch all like celebs and stuff and like what they're doing, but everybody uses Instagram Live now, so this is kind of irrelevant, but whatever uh next application would be gmail and this is like 
really mandatory for me like I need Gmail at all times Google Drive which you can like save videos and stuff too and photos or whatever and back them up Afterlight which is another filter app if you like to take pictures and put nice filters on them yeah Tumblr which I got my background from Campus Portal which I check my grades with very mandatory as well YouTube uh, you know what YouTube is Facetune and I don't really use that as much I don't use it at all really but if I like see something that I don't like in photo then of course I'm gonna touch it up glitch I don't even know why I still have this but it's basically let me show y'all what glitch is ah uh, there's me again okay photo editor and say you want to edit this photo click on glitch and you can like do some cool things to the photo it's so cool <laughs> cool and pointless all right so the next app is music cloud and this is actually the pro version because like I have some music that I really want to listen to like I have to listen to it and it's probably not on SoundCloud or Tidal so I just download it from YouTube or whatever and upload it here. Triller and I rarely use Triller but in case I'm just feeling like dancing or making a cool music video I'm definitely going to go to Triller. The next app would be ASOS and this is just like a shopping app for clothes and stuff. Then the next shopping app would be H&M and I love H&M ASOS as well. But yeah, H&M. Fam, which is like a group chat for iMessage. Fonto, you can like put fonts on pictures and stuff and like download them from Safari. iMovie, which is like a video editor app. And Dub Smash, which is, um, everyone knows what Dub Smash is, but let me show you. So you like could go on here, choose a sound that you want, and like make a video to it. I'm sure y'all seen Dub Smash this before. So that pretty much wraps up this video, guys. If you enjoy, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up. And what was your favorite app in this video?